morning students sai ram today we are going to do revision of chapter 3 addition are you ready with your book and pencil children very good keep it ready okay you have to do lot of working today to find the answers and then you have to take the answer so the question is take the correct option now let us see the first question 294 plus 105 is now you have to write in your book this numbers okay write down this question and add and then find the answer children i am giving you time to find the answer find out quickly you don't have to waste your time quickly you will write 294 plus 105 when you write you can write unit stands 100 above okay so that you will not make mistake in arranging and then you have to add what is the correct answer yes your answer is 399 that is 399 did you got the same answer Uh, do you got the correct answer okay now let us do second sum now second question see 999 plus 4000 what you are going to do first you will write the place unit stands 100000 and you know how to arrange vertically right arrange it properly and then add and tell me what answer you got What is your answer? Got it? Okay. Tell. Okay. Do you got the same answer? Four nine nine. This is your correct answer. What is your correct answer? Four nine nine nine. Okay. Now let us do third question. Ninety nine. Thousand plus seven hundred and two. I am repeating the question. Pay attention. Ninety nine thousand plus seven hundred and two. Now this how you are going to write in figures. It is written in words, right? You have to say which is the correct option for this answer. The options are nine nine zero zero plus seven zero two. Nine nine zero 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 plus seven zero two. Nine nine zero plus seven zero two. Now, how? Which is the correct answer? Write in figures and find out. Yes. What is the correct answer? Nine nine zero 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 plus seven zero two. Okay, this is the correct answer. Now fourth question. The sum of one seven one nine plus four nine two five is. I am repeating the sum of one seven one nine plus four nine two five is. Now you have to write down this number and add. Both are four digit numbers. Okay. and add and find the answer so what answer you got 6644 is the correct answer out of these three options which is the correct answer 6644 that is 6644 check your answer Now we will see fifth question. Five zero three two five and one fifty two is dash. You have to add. Okay, five zero three two five and one five two is dash. The options are fifty thousand five hundred, fifty thousand three hundred seventy seven, fifty thousand four hundred seventy seven. Add and find out the answer. 
yes over so this is the correct answer that is 50477 what is the correct answer 50477 Now let us see sixth question. The sum of biggest two-digit and three-digit number is dash. The sum of biggest two-digit and three-digit number is dash. Now what you will do? You know which is the biggest two-digit number? Ninety-nine. Which is the biggest three-digit number? Nine nine nine. So you have to add these two numbers, and then you have to find the answer. Because when we say sum, sum means you have to add. Okay. What is your answer? Yes. Your answer is one zero nine eight. What is your answer, children? One. Zero nine eight. This is the correct answer. Now seventh question. A zero added to a number does not change the value of the number. Pay attention. A zero added to a number does not change the value of the Number means if you add zero to any number, it will not change the value of that number. Suppose if we say five plus zero equal to what you will get five only. Does it change the value of the number? No. So it is true or false. What is your correct answer then? Yes, your correct answer is what? True. A zero added to a number does not change the value of the number. So your answer should be true. Now we will see eighth sum. Five hundred plus two hundred equal to nine hundred. What you have to do? You have to write down these two numbers. Write and find out. Five hundred plus two hundred. How much you get? Here they told they it is nine hundred, so it is true or false. Add and find out whether it is true or false. Yes, it is false. When you add five hundred plus two hundred, what you get seven hundred. But here it is told it is nine hundred. So your answer is what? False. It is not true. Okay. Now we will see ninth question. Three thousand plus eight thousand equal to dash. Three thousand plus eight thousand equal to dash. Now you have to write these two numbers and add it. I am giving you time. Add and find out. Write three thousand below. Write eight thousand and add both the numbers and find out what is your answer. Yes, children. Yes, very good. What is your answer? Eleven thousand. Okay. What is your answer, children? Eleven thousand. So. This is the correct answer. You should be very careful in adding in exam also. Be careful when you are doing the working. Okay, add, check your answer, and then tick the correct option. Don't be in a hurry. Now, tenth question. The sum of two thousand and ninety is the sum of Two thousand and ninety is. So what you are going to do? Again, I told sum. Sum means you have to add, right? So you will write two thousand. You will write 
90 below it. Okay, arrange properly. And then add both the numbers. Add and find out. I am giving you time. Write 2000 above, below write 90 and add. And then find the answer. What will be the correct answer? Yes, you, you will get 2090. That is, the correct answer is 2090. What is your correct answer? 2090. Okay, let us do next question. 7000 and 3000 is dash. I am repeating the question. 7000 and 3000 is dash. 5000, 10,000, 9000. Add and find the answer children. How much you get? Yes, the correct answer is 7 plus 3 is how much? 10. So, your answer is 10,000. What is your correct answer? 10,000. Now, 12th question. 3th plus 2h plus 6t plus 1u is dash. 3th plus 2H plus 6T plus 1U is dash. Options are 3661, 3261, 3126. 3TH means 3000, 2H means 200, 6T means 60 and 1 u means 1 so you have to add all this and then you have to find the answer what is your correct answer find out yes your answer is 3 2 6 1 your correct answer is 3 2 6 1 now we will see 13th question Okay, 8t plus 5t is dash. 8t plus 5t is dash. 8t means how much you will write? 80. Plus 5t means 50. When you add this, how much you get? 13t, 13h. Or 13 th. Okay. Pay attention. 13 t. 13 h. Or 13 th. What is your correct answer? Yes. Your correct answer is. 13 t. Okay. Let us do. Next question. Okay. 6 0 9. And 200 is dash. I repeat 609 and 200 is dash. You have to find the answer. Add this number 609 and 200. The options are 800, 809 or 890. Add and find out the answer. Yes. What is the correct answer? 809 that is 809 this is the correct answer children now we will see next question 15th one 1000 plus 4000 is 5000 1000 plus 4000 is 5000 true or false you have to add and find out the answer. Add and find. Is it correct or no? And then tick true or false. What is your answer? Yes. When you add 1000 plus 4000, you get how much? 5000. So, it is true. 
so with this we have completed revision of all the three chapters now you have to revise this videos again because you will get the idea this type of questions are going to come for the exam and all the best for your unit test children do it well okay thank you